hello everyone today in this video i want to install fedora minimal just like arch so sorry i mean oh virtual box on the virtual box as new in fedora the iso the net install iso i will give this link in the description next everything is looking fine uh two two setting ah not ram it was ram 5gb will more than enough and things fine let's launch let's mount it video 37 there are pre-con bigger i3 profi i say this is my dot file and you just need to give this script to get all the my dot config file there are pre-configure i3 profi sxh kd pulsar uh, atom basically a atom fork and the notification server wallpaper gtk3 quake is a drop down terminal and i3 status already i'm using and volume icon this one All right dot file and english so so let's create the partition first we will create a new partition and that will be our that will be our bios boot partition and encryption will be off it will take two megabyte okay next up a uh, new partition it will be our uh, ext4 partition mount where point will be put we will uh, create two encrypted partition home and root so we have to create another partition for the boot and it will be ext4 partition and level will be empty level empty is okay and uh, encryption will be off definitely next up Ah shit. <laughs> so we want to create a partition for that we will tab on right click and then new and select the select the file system bios boot it will take two megabyte and okay next up create a new partition it will be file system will be ext4 level let's keep it empty and mounted mount point will be slash boot slash boot next up it will uh, minimum required about uh, 512 mb but let's keep it uh, 900 not gb mb 999 okay so this will be don't encrypt this partition uh, everything's fine uh, next up let's uh, create half half mm, 15 gb for let's give 15 gb for root partition 15 gb for the root partition and i will create this uh, butterfs because the default file system of fedora is butterfs and butterfs is far far better and mount point will be slash. yes i'm creating yes and if there are if they are bigger if you see any uh, anything like level then just add slash and then 
uh, not at the rate root if you see anything like level just take it but if i select from here button refresh then it is not showing so this probably fine uh, okay next rest of the partition i will give it um, button refresh and it will be slash home just like that if you see any level make that uh, at the red home like this at the red home mount point is not at the red home but if you see level uh, fill that blank with at the red home and encryption oh i forgot to encrypt that partition uh, okay just keep a password for encryption partition password okay i forgot to encrypt the root partition edit it edit and delete butter face mount point is root and click it okay nice uh, thank you everything looks fine drive is completely encrypted secured and software selection we will be do fedora custom operating system which is the most minimal and everything i will not check mark anything because i know what i need and i already made this dot file and i will run this dot rn slash sh all the configuration and package what i needed is installed i will explain this one by one ha, uh, okay let's install start and fedora minimal is installing and let me describe my this gitlab repo so very simple uh, if you want to run if you want to install this repo repo just paste this on your terminal uh, and it will first update your dnf mm, if you don't know what this command do basically in ubuntu you know there is a command like sudo apt update and sudo apt upgrade just this one line will do the same thing if you are coming from the arch sudo pacman dash s y y u u and sudo dnf install git and copy the download this repository open change directory to that re, to the repository and then sudo chmod plus x basically it will give the permission to this file executable permission plus x and run this run this script so if you run this script first uh, <clears throat> this command will add it to this file dnf.config file which will basically search for the fastest mirror next max parallel download will be 3 uh, you can change it to 5 7 if you have better internet connection but i think 3 will be enough for me uh, keep cache it will make more simple color is always and sudo dnf update refresh uh, next install zsh uh, powerful shell bash alternative and make uh, zsh the default shell this command will do that next up sudo dnf install pack uh, flat pack uh, uh, flat pack add uh, next up uh, enabling rpm fusion uh, you can install a third party software from rpm fusion and my i3 window manager this is a Mm, basically a, a GUI app store Pcom uh, is a compositor uh, if you keep the opacity trans <coughs> transparency way is a lightweight uh, <coughs> file wallpaper manager <coughs> uh, 
keep remember you can install this you can install this on any fedora the login ls ls dash a pwd if you want to see where i am okay so first of all we will update the system sudo Red filterability. Peter. Sudo. Uh, no, not that bit. Okay, sudo DNF install. Next up, uh, let's clone this directory. Clone tiny one. Fedora. It clone tiny dot one slash Fedora. Fedora doesn't exist. Oh, HTTPS colon slash slash colon slash slash tiny one slash Fedora. Copying the repo. Don't run this command. Sure. Synchronize script file. Let's run this one. Instead of six, failed. Okay. Sudo system CTL enable and set default capital target. i3 by default if i want to open a terminal mod key or you can say windows key mod key plus enter oh, auto generate plus mod key plus enter 
ls cd fedora ls uh, now i want to i want to run that run script sudo chmod plus x uh, run dot sh giving the executable permission ls now dot slash run which it added those three lines did those four line password for changing the shell we'll run this one <clears throat> just wait for five minutes to giving it will record two times password so just wait I had a Arch distribution. This one, Arch is Linux for repo. Uh, almost it about one year ago. I didn't maintain anymore this Arch because.